Savat kick, Navajo Warrior style. And the knee. And Kobe experienced a bit of a pushback to his desired frenetic pace there. Yeah, as RBD was really giving it all he had there. Oh, 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 foot meet face. Rolling Thunder. RBD just showing why he is the whole damn show. As unorthodox as it is effective. Kobe Kingston needs to rally. You can tell RBD is lighting up now. Talk about a crowd in unison. RBD has them on the edge of their seats. A great evasion from Kofi. Paying back with their own counter. Big forearm. Oh, God. Brutal chop block. Great athleticism. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Launching. You gotta be kidding me. It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring. There is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. Rob Van Dam. Oh, the way to the outside. You want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. Van Dam is just taking command. Kofi has to trust his instincts at this point. Well-framed standing moonsault. The end may be in sight for his opponent here. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Leg breaker. He was waiting for him to make his move. Spin kick. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Trailer pile driver, my goodness. Kofi couldn't avoid the big shot. Referee's count only getting higher. Come on, got to get back in the ring. Kingston running into some trouble, guys. Yeah, RBD is firing on all cylinders. A show of... And that will going to do it, folks. Here Perfect time to attack when his guard is down. A count-out win is still a win. When it comes down to the record books, a win is a win no matter the conditions. They should still be proud. The bell rings, and CM Punk ready to compete here tonight. The Defiant Punk never afraid to get in your... ...face and just scrap with all he's got. Oh, yeah, Punk has a him-against-the-world mentality. Never one to shy away from a fight. Always ready to back up everything he has to say in and out of the ring. Punk is never going to let the chip fall off his shoulder, especially since it's gotten him very far in this business. And then we've got Kofi Kingston, one of the most dynamic superstars in all of WWE. And when the WWE Universe is in Kofi's corner, there's no opponent he can't topple. No tricky situation he can't recover from. We should really keep that in mind here. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. And that explosive style of Kingston got dampened a bit there. <laughs> Discouraging results for Kofi. And Kofi needs to stay positive. Kofi Kingston is about as difficult of an opponent as they come. So what's the strategy for someone? Clothesline. 
And a second. This superstar building momentum. Sweeping the leg. Things are looking up. CM Punk with a joy in your doggy. Look at this. I'm not quite sure this man shouldn't tap out. This is about career longevity, self-preservation. Oh, a couple Ooh. of knees there. That'll get him out of it. He just barely dodges. And see him. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Turning the tables there. What's Kofi gonna do? A beautiful monkey flip. Follows up with a Kofi. He kicks out before the count starts. It's unthinkable. Someone beating the one count at this point. As the lane trails, fisherman suplex. Looking for the victory. Two. No, he gets the shoulder up. How? How? And the DDT. CM Punk on shaky legs for a bit. Yeah, Kofi making it clear he's out here to prove a point, to prove just how good he is. There's a bulldog. Punk is shaky. The end of the track for him could be near. Kofi kicks it. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. And a kick out. What on earth? Unbelievable. Kick out at one. Unbelievable, more like inhuman. On a normal night, that wins it for Kofi, but tonight is proving to be a much different night. He takes control. Oh, oh what an axe handle. Elbow drop. Piercing. Boom. Oh, he yeah, had Kofi scouted. CM Punk has him up. Go to sleep. Nobody can withstand that. Not even Kofi. What's the fuck are you For doing? the win. There's two. Got it. And Hulk is your winner. Here is your winner. Oh, 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 yeah. What are you doing, Stretchy? Kobe Kingston is a man who lives and breathes the power of positivity. He truly believes that if you have faith In yourself, good things are bound to come your way. Absolutely, Michael, and it's hard to argue with the results. Kobe's had a career full of incredible achievements, breathtaking moments, and huge triumphs. When you put it that way, Byron, one thing's for sure, we can all use a little more positivity in our lives. But we all know there is no stopping CM Punk when he is determined. Yeah, he may be blunt, he may rub certain people the wrong way, but Punk is always itching for a fight. It seems like that slap might have had a little extra hostility behind it. And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. This is not going to end well. The Exploder! Discouraged! 
encouraging results for Kofi. Kofi has to rely on his veteran instincts to come back. Kofi loves to fly, loves to work at a frenetic, fast pace. Corey, do you think that will... Oh, look at this! Is it enough, guys? Is Shot it enough to get back in this match? Wow. So far, so good. Pop's got the Anaconda Vice in. Will he tap out? Will he tap out? An extreme amount of pressure. Kneeing his way out. And he's free. And an elbow. And Kofi hit with some true offensive adversity right there. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. And CM Punk is in control. CM Punk is stifling the opposition now. Oh, that hurt. Stomping. Ouch. Boom. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. Oof. He's trying to intimidate his opponent one more time, but he's got to strike soon. Trying to debilitate the capability to stand. Expected that one. Spin kick to the midsection. Backhand hits the target. CM Punk has him up. Sleep. Big problem for Kofi Kingston. Is it enough? The cover. He kicks out somehow. Tremendous heart on display from Kingston with that kick out. Can he stay in this match after such a close call? Punk took his best shot, gave him everything. Punk plants him with a Yonagi. Seamless transition into the Anaconda Vice. It's not embarrassing to tap out. He'll save your career. But no, he lets him out. Yeah, I think he knew he wasn't going to get the submission there. Oof. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. The foot DDT! Oh, he's got him by the leg! Working on the leg. Oh! And CM Punk's maintaining the advantage now. Punk is just doing what he pleases. Power slam! Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Punk looking for G. Uh oh. Kofi gets out of the way. Placing them right where they want them into the corner. Hold on. Hoping to end it here. And he kicks out of the pin and one. Refusing to give up even an inch of ground as this match continues. Whoa. That'll fillet your chest. Kofi just taunting his opponent now. Powerful contact by Kingston. Oh, and look at the baseball slide. Whoa! Into the Hurricane Rana. Nicely done. And that can end up putting CM Punk on shaky legs for a bit. Yeah, Kobe's physicality is in full effect. Elbow puts an end to that. Oh, look at this. Jack Craig after the float over. That was pretty. Look out! He returns to the ring. Oh, and just completely off target there. Paying the price of treating your own body like a human crash test dummy. Springboard off the top row right cross body. Hulk looking for GTS. Gotta sleep. Come on, Kofi. Get up. That's gotta be it. Two. It is it. Finally, it's over. Here is your winner.
There's the start of this false count anywhere match, one of the most grueling stipulations in all of wrestling. The sheer physical punishment these two are willing to put themselves through just to settle this thing between them, it's something that few people can really understand. Ooh! Ooh! Oh, the heel hook stretch. Bam! Clearly waiting for that. Push! Ooh. From a seated position, this takes tremendous power. Suplex delivered. That there showed as massive as Batista is, he's not impenetrable. And now Batista's being dismantled. The apex predator decimating Batista. He's taking a moment to feel the crowd, but he better focus on the opposition. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. Determination in his eyes, and now a kendo stick in his hands. This could be it. Cover. Raises the shoulder before the one count. He couldn't make much of that pin attempt. Ooh. No disqualifications has to benefit a certain type of superstar more than others, doesn't it, Corey? Get off your high horse, Cole. A no disqualification match benefits the superstar who's smarter, faster, and better. Using the rules to your advantage doesn't make you the villain here. Ooh, focused attack on the neck. Together. The attacks will not relent from the Viper, delivering nasty stops. And if the first stop doesn't send you the message, the follow-up ones definitely will. Up the hole, a slam. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. He's thinking a steel chair is just what he needs to wreak some havoc here. He foiled that attempt. Oh, that wasn't pretty, but it was effective. Cole, I think we know what the Viper's doing. Yeah, Randy Orton with in position. Viper DDT. Just as he planned, Orton with the precision there. Pinpoint accuracy with that one. Batista able to work that off. He's heading up top. Thinking big. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Suplex! Oh. oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. You can't take much more of this. There is no way this can go on for much longer. But okay. oh. That can finish Batista off. Goodness gracious. Able to parry that one. Drop kick. Gets countered there. Will it be? An ineffective pin. How did he do that? <laughs> Delivers the leg drop. This fight has made its way to the entrance way. Oh man, so many things can go wrong now. to reverse that one. Military press. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. The methodical style of Orton got a bit stalled there. Seeing some no-nonsense offense from Batista. Explode suplex. Torture their opponent. Uh oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, man. And there was some force on that move. Batista just viciously destroying Orton. Amazing. The animal looking for it. Here it comes. Match ending power.
He's going for the pin. This could be it. Makes a cover. Instantly, he has his shoulders up. He didn't even let the ref start the count. Oh, my God. Direct in their attack on the neck. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. That kick will stop you in your tracks. Oh, ooh, stomp to the tummy. Tummy? Tummy. The sadistic mind of the viper and rage of the animal are at war. This is what competition in WWE is all about. Both men are on a mission to wipe each other out. Oh, the is universal close. signal for extreme. The kendo stick has entered the fray. Orton a bit dismayed, but we know the Viper is adept at remaining on the offensive. Bullseye with the drop kick. And you can see the anguish coming through. Usually the adrenaline of competing masks how hurt you really are, but the pain must be really manifesting itself. Axe handle. He moved, but can he capitalize? Steering attention to the neck. Precision offense from the Viper. Orton loves to have this kind of control. Batista sidesteps it. Hit drop. I've been waiting for the victory here. Kicks out. He still has life. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. Orton with a fence press. And now here come the punches. Dodged right on cue. Damn. Set up for the front oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. And well timed maneuver there. Orton not intimidated, not even close. If anything, he's the one doing the intimidating right now, Michael. And he goes into the ring. That is a power-packed punch. Punch connects. Ooh. A heel hook. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch, too. Kick. He knew that was coming. And now Batista's being dismantled. The animal has got to turn the aggression on to survive. Oh my gosh! Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. The Viper able to strike. That one has to end this. Is that how it The WWE Universe showing the love for these superstars who have given them so much strength. Elbow drop. He may get the three count right here. Yeah, I think so. And that'll do it. It's finally over with the win.
Bobby Lashley may just be the closest thing we've ever seen to a superhuman being here in WWE. His physique and raw power are practically unbelievable. That's what makes him the almighty Bobby Lashley. He's more than just your average competitor. He's an exceptional wrestler with exceptional skills. And he certainly looks eager to put those skills to good use here in this match. And he's facing off against Kofi Kingston, a man who always has the power of positivity on his side. As cheesy as that is, there's no denying what Kofi's been able to accomplish with it. Tossing their opponent like they're nothing. Just a perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. Oh! Showing off their deadlifting prowess and just getting tossed. I'll just leave it at this. Nobody comes into a match hoping to get chucked around like that. All the way up, the big time power oh. bomb. Kingston running into some trouble, guys. And Lashley is carefully calculating every movement. Drop kick finds the spot. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. He gets out of the way. Close line. What impact. He's looking a little off balance. Lashley showing off his superhuman power with that attack. Power bomb. What goes up must come down, and it sure as hell did right there. Kofi Kingston is about as difficult of an opponent as they come. So what's the strategy for someone with Kofi's toughness, his resolve, his athleticism? Well, Kofi's one tough cookie, but eventually he'll crumble, especially if he underestimates your stamina. Be relentless. Stay on Kofi. Don't give him an inch and hope that he runs out of steam before you do. Able to interrupt the attack. Vicious right forearm. He had it scouted. Bobby Lashley. Oh, man, this dude is so powerful as he delivers. Kofi escapes a predicament. Competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Take off. Yeah. Look out below. And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. Close line. Elbow drop. Piercing. And Kobe hit with some true offensive adversity right there. Lashley once again establishing himself as dominance personified there. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent and tossing them aside. What now? Uh, stop right to the gut. Ooh. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. What are you guys thinking? Obviously, spear. Big problem for Kofi Kingston. The Almighty can impose. It's over. Nice work. Here is not allowing that to go on any longer. Three of WWE's top competitors ready for this triple threat match. No ending this fight right now. He'd be out of it after taking that maneuver. I've lost count of how many times this match should have ended by now. Corey, this match gives competitors so much to consider. So much to be on the lookout for. What are some of the hazards? You never know when you're going to be blindsided. Or which opponent will try to jack you up next. 
allies become enemies at a moment's notice. A competitor needs every ounce of situational awareness they have if they're going to survive this. You gotta check your chin. Front face lock applied into an airplane spin. Look at this power. Oh, wow. Lights out. Well executed hip toss. Arm ringer applied. Down for a European arm breaker. He's lost some of his win now. Smart offense delivered by Noah. Puts him up a spine buster. Is it enough? The cover. Oh, foot just stomping down. Just one step ahead. Boy, oh, European uppercut. He made it. Low blow. How cheap is that? Oh, ouch. I think they all know what we're about to see. No way Dar's coming back from that. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. No clue what he hopes to find down there. Oh, man. If you're going to grab a kendo stick, you better be prepared to use it. Joe Coffey is dictating the pace now. Cash needs to figure things out. Oh, wow. The superstar hooking the arm. Look at this rush of strikes. Oh, what an intense striking combination. Wow, clubbing blow to the back. Double axe handle. Boom, right across the small of the back. He's taking this to the floor now. Lands face first. Well, this will damage your back. No, I'm just rubbing it in now. Close line. So effective. He's back into the ring. Oh, look at the hammer lock. And there's more. Down on the arm. Beautiful. He's in a little bit of trouble now. This should come as no surprise. In a havoc-filled triple threat, you're going to take some big hits. Fishing for something beneath the ring. And here comes Old Faithful. The steel chair is in hand. Sure, he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. That elbow looked like it hurt. Kick to the midsection. Oh, this is so much fun to watch. Oh, the momentum into a spinning power bomb. Joe Coffey on his last breath. Hoisting their opponent. Oh, Fisherman's Buster! <laughs> Returning to the ring now. Suplex! Our official just took a big hit. Oh, come on. Let's keep it clean in there. Wheelbarrow Face Buster! Man. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. Planning on what to do next. Through the escape as that maneuver was taking just too long to materialize. He has a kendo stick in hand, and this place just turned into South Swanson Street. And we just saw some serious offense. He steers clear of contact. And these attacks are spilling nothing but trouble. See who can find a way to keep going. And back in the ring we go. He can't take any more of this. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. Raped across the top rope. Clubbing four. He wants it one more time. Joe can sense victory. And landing with the 
double axe handle. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's gonna hurt. Cranking the head. Norm Dar position. Escape just in time. What a raucous crowd here tonight. Down in a hurry. Nice running crossbody. Oh. He leaves the ring and there's no count outs in this one. He grabbed the chair. Uh, now would be a good time to run. Let's just all take a moment to truly appreciate and embrace his presence. And things looking dire for Cash. You have to be impressed with Noam's composure at this point. He's answered everything this fight's thrown at him. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. And Joe holding him at bay. Reversals, reversals, and more reversals. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. Oh, oh what an uppercut. Joe. to the floor. And Joe saw it coming. Uppercut. He can end it here. He's got him. No, stops the count at two. I mean, you got to think he's just one. Uh-oh, uh-oh. A long way. Triple threat. Here is your winner, Cash Suplex. Good long match. Just get my ass kicked. Top of the leaderboard. Yeah. Good that. Slick trick with you, baby.
And you can already hear the roar of the crowd as this ladder match gets underway. That's because there is no way to predict what we're about to see in this match, Michael. A ladder match really is the epitome of high risk, high reward. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. What a knee lift! Uh-oh. He's got the answer for that one. Setting up. Nice suplex. What a throw of the much larger opponent. Ooh, big forearm. Ooh, merciless looking blow. Solid punch. Heavy body shots. Whipped hard. What a close line. Just punched him right in the mouth. Right to the face. My God. Byron looks like that ladder is perfectly placed. Hey, you can't ask for a much better spot than that. Making their way up the ladder right now. This is a nerve-wracking situation. Trying to stick a victory here. Huge spot in this match right here, guys. He steps foot in the ring again. Uh -oh. Look at this snatch of victory here, guys. I don't think it's gonna happen. Bang! He's fighting to stay alive here, guys. Scratching and clawing. Clearly not afraid to take the fight up high. Oh, what a shot! Gets out of there in a hurry. Look at this. Can he grab it? It's inches away. An aggressive move going for it now, but I, I think I like it. It's not gonna work out. And that's all she wrote. Switch it up. I'm gonna try to switch it up. I don't wanna get bored of any character. Traditionally, things have to get to a pretty heated place for superstars to end up in a steel cage. The cage is designed to keep all interference and distraction out of the equation. In the steel cage, it's just you and your opponent. Nobody in, nobody out. A power bomb like that will leave you with bruises and remind you of this moment for days. And some effective offense for that one. And that was a well-executed attack. Oh, this is just disrespectful. And an elbow drop, too. And Bubba clearly ready for a fight here. Words off that offense from Bubba. And Bubba Ray responds. Uh -oh. What is a crucial component of this type of matchup? Well, whether you're a master of submission maneuvers or a novice, you need to focus on a part of your opponent's anatomy and target it relentlessly. And you have to lock it in tight to reduce the chance of your opponent reversing the maneuver or breaking out of it. Lock it in, make them tap, collect your winnings. That is the name of the game. Fortitude being tested with every step. Takes a painful fall from the cage. Oh, that could not have felt good. Oh, kick lands. I don't know if this is a good idea. This is going to take more strength than he has left. A lift up power bomb. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. Ooh. Uh oh, this is not going to end well. Big time power. Uh-oh. Elbow drop. Jay looking powerless to every attack. Yeah, but Uso's just one move from turning this around. Spiked. Booty boot. He's starting to struggle here. 
Yeah, Cole, and now's the time you need to slap a submission on your opponent before they get one on you. Bubba launches him into a Bubba Cutter. Jay is down and out. Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. And that might be the start of the momentum swing that Jay needed. But Jay still has more to do to get this fight fully in his favor. He's making Hayes climbing up the cage wall. From the top. Are you kidding me? Oh, smashing the jaw. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. out of trouble. German suplex! Oh, this is just disrespectful. Oh, an elbow drop for added measure. Oh, here it comes! Spiked! Sit out, pile driver! Open sesame, he says! Open that door up! Very interesting, not wasting any time. Getting that door wide open. The door is wide open and unimpeded. He is about to make his successful escape. An emphatic victory. Here is your winner. The latter can be your best friend or your worst enemy in a Money in the Bank match. You have to be acutely aware of the positioning of the ladder. Sometimes it's an extra participant in the match. Just climbing the ladder and holding the contract is not enough to win. Exactly, Corey. The ladder must be directly below the briefcase. Got him up high! A tornado bomb! DDT! <laughs> oh, that's gonna sting. Ah, uh, put the brakes on funk. Here's my sterling advice for ladder match participants. Before you even think of climbing up that ladder, you better make absolutely sure that your opponents are down and out. The last thing you want is to be interrupted during your climb because you refuse to lay in some extra offense beforehand. Yeah, you should never pass up with a chance to further incapacitate the competition. That was definitely an attempt to take off some of the rock shine there. Go for the arm bar. And, a, and that was a hell of a DDT there. That was not just painful on the shoulder. That pain can shoot all the way. in the nick of time. I oh, a handle. Really just laying it in. Tough position to be caught in here. What now? What now? Into the barricade. You want to control the tempo? You want to dictate the pace? Thrown around like a sack of do you know what? Huge boot. Look at this. Just unloading. And a Ooh. stop to the gut, too. Double leg takedown. Stepping through. Crossing the legs. Can they cinch it in? Yes. Sharpshooter apply. Well, this won't win the match, but it's... He's trying to push himself up, and that'll cause a break. What a counter. He'll have the ring. for their troubles. Any 
barely evades. Heads out of the ring. What's next? But can they follow up on this momentum? Can they make the club spin? That's the kind of big move it takes to succeed in a match like this. But now, can he muster up the energy to make the climb up the ladder? Gunbuster! Here we go, right in the center of the ring. A perfect place to set up that ladder. take things into the ring. But he's still got to climb the ladder. That's the only way this match ends. The Rock has him hurt. And now is the time to act and go for that brass ring. A win here would be a bit of a surprise. Shock. It seems a bit early to be going for the win, if you ask me. Not if they can win it right here, though. Oh, the... Charlotte Flair is the self-proclaimed queen of WWE, a title that aptly describes the illustrious career she's had here and the superior attitude she takes toward her fellow competitors. 
The Queen's reign here has been impressive to say the least. A truly royal competitor who is head and shoulders above the rest of the rabble in the locker room. Charlotte deserves all the riches she's earned here. Laying it on a little thick there, Corey, but there really is no arguing against Charlotte's dominance inside the ring. And we're here in Orlando, a breeding ground for many of the WWE's top superstars, thanks to the Performance Center. Breeding ground for great commentators, too, and, and there's Saxton. I don't know how you got bred. She's feeling the hurt here. Vicious headbutt. Charlotte is losing grasp of this match now. Charlotte's got to find a way to put her best foot forward here. Oh, look at just ripping at the eyes and the face. Von Erich-esque. That was just wrong. You should be a better person than that. That well scouted. Charlotte showing how much punishment she can withstand before dishing out some of her own. The U-turn Charlotte needed in this match could have been that right there. We all know Charlotte has all the tools to any match she competes in, but Corey, can you think of any specific strategy for her tonight? Cole, you're absolutely right about Charlotte already having all the tools. She needs to focus and remember that, which honestly shouldn't be a problem for her. She's Charlotte Flair. No muss, no fuss on that delivery. Someone clearly doesn't want this match to go on much longer than it has to. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Back in the ring now. Wow, the power that takes is insane. One strong attack after another. That looks painful. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, look at this aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. Big running leg drop. And Charlotte can't find an answer for these attacks. Charlotte trying to withstand this surge. Attack after attack on target. Oh, we know what's coming next. Sumo and spike to the throat. Catches a kick into a dragon screw leg whip. And she finds an answer to Charlotte. One more time. Four. He is on the slide. For class and stuff. Huh? Gross. That's fine. I can do that. Okay. myself the same question. I have no idea. Cover. Two count. No. Two count. Really had less than a second to stay alive there. She's not worried about this crowd. She's not going to let them face her one bit. And a nice takedown. Hooked up. Now oh, look at the power. Side slam. She heads out, but this one can be lost by count out. Ooh, she just turned it around. And another counter. Ooh. Charlotte just rubbing it in now. Hoist it up from behind. Oh, my goodness. The accordion wreck. And a rack drop. And that could do Charlotte. Oh, what a headbutt. And again. How many headbutts are we going to see? Six. Backbreaker. My goodness. Look at the torque. Dropped. Roll the credits. This one's done. Count out.
minute. She needs to get back in. Oh, it is aggression. Just too brutality. Oh, easy. This is her time to shine, and don't you forget. Oh, boy, that's a deterrent. And that's all she wrote. Here is your winner. There's no telling what a competitor is capable of once that cage door is locked. I shudder to think what individuals are capable of when they're surrounded by 15 feet of steel. Once you are in the cage and the door is locked, the time for talk is over. It's all business. There is nowhere to run and nowhere to hide. Torture rack. Just deadlifting their opponent. And tossing their opponent like they're nothing. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just gotta toss another person to make a statement. Ooh, that's how you dominate your opponent. Hurled away. God. Not the prettiest thing you'll ever see, but it sure looks effective from here. And Raquel's keeping the pressure on. Rare to see Asuka in distress like this. And it looks like Asuka was the one who wasn't ready for that attack. Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. Oh! Oh, my God, what impact. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Elbow drop. Piercing. Targeting the neck, right after the neck. Boom! Oscar's being overwhelmed. Raquel isn't holding anything back. Oh, kick right to the spine. Ooh, stinging kick. How can a superstar use the cage to their advantage? It's as much a weapon as it is an enclosure. Pinfall, submission, escaping the cage. It's all much easier when you're using the unforgiving steel to keep the opposition down. Like they're nothing. Ooh, she hit the corner hard. Reversal from Raquel. And Raquel Rodriguez with an epic top bar. Will that stop Oscar? She wants the door open. She says it is time to end this thing. Hurry up, ref. He's about to get her wish. <laughs> Is looking beaten down, guys. Not what you want to see by any means. Tossing them aside. And Rodriguez is now dictating the pace. This has to be a bit demoralizing for the Empress. Have you ever seen a human being tossed like that? She's getting back up, but she might be down again soon. She scores big with the counter. Snapmare takedown. Oh, roundhouse kick. Nasty kick to the face. That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh, man. Looks like her opponent's not going to need a chiropractor. Boom! Oh, what a close line. Ooh! She's ordering the ref to open the door. The official following her orders. 
Could he move any slower? Look at this. She's going to take a leisurely stroll out of the cage. <laughs> I didn't expect this to happen. A dominating performance. It's over all in a night's nice work. Here is your winner, Raquel Rodriguez. An always thrilling steel cage match. Unpredictable to the very end, but there's the survivor. Rodriguez able to walk out of here the winner. It's a two out of three falls matchup here where the first to achieve two falls will be our winner. In this one, we see the manifestation and Raquel Rodriguez. And across from them, they will be squaring off with Blair Davenport and Zelina Vega. It's not the first fall that matters most. It's the last one. I hope these competitors are ready for a complete change of pace. That showed a complete lack of respect for your competition and for our sport. Showing off the quickness, that'll turn things around. In the Corey, is that first fall the most important one in a two out of three match? Some people see it that way, but it's obviously the second fall that really counts. The first fall can be a confidence boost, but the second one is the one that gets your hand raised. Tossing them aside. It wasn't the height or distance that caused the damage, but they certainly contributed. From way up top, a double axe handle. And what a throw that was. That's using your head. And that has Blair searching for answers. Ooh! Raquel displaying a dominant presence. Front face lock applied into an airplane spin. Look at this power. And that might be seen triple after that. Just try to hit the one in the middle. Tossing their opponent like they're nothing. Whoa. A bit of hot dogging from Blair here. Whoa. And gets tossed back into the mat. Showing out their deadlifting prowess and just heaved aside. Jeez. Uh oh. She adjusts it and reverses it. Someone's got to get back to the ring now. Big time. She's lost some of that energy she had earlier. Showing off their deadlifting prowess and just tossing them aside. Look at the power of Raquel Rodriguez. Has her opponent up and a body bar. Straight into the barricade. Well-timed counter on Rodriguez. Such a great example of confidence she's showing here. Big time spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. And Zelina can't stop it. We're about to see. Some control in there. Oh, it is aggression, just pure brutality. Oh, easy. Schoolboy into the pin. She's going for it. Oh, that gets reversed into the cover. She gets the shoulder up. Somehow 
she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Got the tag. Got the tag. some power here. Look at this strength. Absolutely impressive. And that was a precisely measured attack. And that was a well-targeted attack. And now she retreats. And quickly she has to take this moment to pull herself together. Out of the way in time. Pop up there. Steel cage match reserved for competitors who can't settle their differences any other way. Surrounding yourself with unforgiving steel. You're really trying to end a rivalry once and for all when you agree to this match. My goodness, absolute dominance. All the way up. Of the gut wrench suplex. Well, they say everyone has a plan until they get punched in the mouth. Well, someone just threw their plan out the window. Power slam. Oh, this is just flat out punishment. Look at this. Deadlifting their opponent. Power slam. Just unveiling the full extent of muscle with those attacks. Wait for it. Alabama slam. And when you can manhandle your opposition like this, you become a lion playing with its food. Oh, nasty flipping senton. Looks like Carly Prime has taken the upper hand. Stratton's got to find a way to defend herself. What a German suplex. Steered clear of that. Down with a tip the world backbreaker. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. To the belly. This match is wearing her down. And as this match drags on, all that damage is only going to make it harder to fight out of a submission hole. Any words of wisdom for a competitor trapped inside a steel cage? You must find ways to use the harsh confines and the sheer size of the cage to your advantage. Throw your opponent into, maybe even off of the cage to inflict maximum pain. Make your biggest obstacle your biggest asset. Oh, square shot with the back elbows ends that. Ah, oh, down. The superstar goes. Momentum being built. Tremendous resilience. You can feel the growing confidence. Uh-oh. Up and... Face first. That was awesome. Tiffany's on Dream Street. Sweet freedom just inches away as the door is signaled to open.
Making it out of the ring. This could be it. And that'll about do it, folks. Here is your winner, Carly Rod. And we are locked and loaded for this tag team matchup. Getting this one underway, we have Pretty Ruthless, Bailey, Raquel Rodriguez, and the Manifestation. Then the opposing team is, of course, filled with Charlotte, Trish Stratus, Bianca Belair, and Becky Lynch. This match can very well come down to experience. And I'm not just talking about individual experience. I'm talking about the experience you have with your partner. Knowing how to be on the same page is going to be crucial. Running crossbody. Oh, ouch. Caught in the hard way. Ooh, knee drop connects. Arch forearm draped across the middle rope. Hot shot stunner. Oh, there's the old. The stump puller. Leg snap. their opponent all the way up just holding their opponent there that's a one one thousand two one thousand three one thousand four one thousand they can go all night now with one arm she turns it right around with a counter and both athletes showing that they have each other's number Just another insane display of power. Hammerlock wrenched in. Damn it, to the arm! That's gotta be it! She doesn't even get a count of one! Late in the match, but somehow has the incomparable power to kick out before the one count. She's able to get the tag by the skin of her teeth. Turns it around. She's staying elusive. Oh, low tackle. Slips out of the way. Into a sidewalk slam. Attack from behind. Oh, right after the neck. Look at the power. Of Raquel Rodriguez has her opponent up and good lord, what a slam! Cover! And they're still in this! And then back to Stratus. Across the top rope, what a hot shot! Into the corner, this can't be good! And she denies Charlotte.
She manages to... Rodriguez hoists her up. To Hallibur. Is that what it takes to beat Charlotte? This is not the time to be diverting attention away from your opponent. So she tags in. <laughs> Reminding her who all these people really paid to see. Jack face first. All on the apron, lifting it up into the ring. Bam, suplex. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, it is aggression, just pure oh, brutality. Come on, easy. Play of hits coming your way now. Doing whatever it takes. Flair retaliating. Turning the tables. Oh. Just hot shot it to the outside. Tag made. Oh, man, taking it to the trachea. is losing command in this one. Lynch is going to have to dig down deep here. And no two ways of bat it. That move was just dirty. What a face buster. She gets Becky with a counter. And that might be the start of the momentum swing she needed. Yeah, she's able to momentarily stop the bleeding, but will she also gain command of this match? Everything's going against her now. She's been pushed into a bad spot for sure. She's going for it. Kick out. She still has life. She just will not go away. Up across the shoulders. Oh. Incredible torque on the spine. Just like an accordion. Oh. Shoulders down. Just in time. What a hot shot. It's all the way to the outside. Straight impact on the throat. This is going to be stiff. Vicious backdrop suplex. Bailey turning up the intimidation factor. Oh, man. Becky holds her off. Ah, oh, takedown. And now punches right. Oh, oh, my goodness. Just strike it at will. Boom, what a punch. Yes, tag. Nasty one right to the chest. And Bailey connected nicely there. Going well, right after the shin. Dragon screw. Oh, God. Face first. Oh, sent flying. Hit the ropes. Brutal knee to the side of the face. Bailey controlling the pace now. That killer instinct from Bailey is shining through. She returns the favor there. What is she looking for here? And down. Oof. Well scouted by Stratus. She is going to look to... Bailey sending her over. Spike with a rose plant. Is Bailey closing this out? Wow, the ref got hit hard there. That goes to show you what Bailey thinks of her opponent here. Dragon screw, beautiful. Stratus needs to figure this out. Trish looks to have been well scouted. She makes the tag. 
She is unleashed. Between the top and middle of the world. He got the shoulders down. And a strong kick out at one. Her iron will on display for the world to see. And that was a heck of a heave we just saw. Things have gotten worse for Becky Lynch. She could be out of this match. Yeah, this is not good. You don't say, Saxton. Shinbreaker. Not done yet. Jeez. Into the dragon screw. I oh, able to counter. Sleeper slam. Net breaker. Uh-oh. Oh, the power. The strength of Dominator. Looking for the victory. Two. But that is Stratus. Oh, 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 no. She breaks the ref's count. Right now, I just don't know what it's going to take. A great agility. She'll make the tag. <laughs> oh, the Fez pressing out. Are they biting them and then smashing their head into the mat? More bites and more smashes. Why? Why? Now she's allowing the WWE Universe to simply soak it all in. Incoming. Crash landing. Here we go in this matchup where the first to achieve two falls will be our winner tonight. We are getting this battle underway as we see Charlotte.
and Bailey. Now they will be facing some fierce tag team action with Charlotte and China. The first fall is integral in a match like this. It really sets the tone and momentum moving forward. So it'll be interesting to see if there are any attempts to try to get that first fall quickly in this one. No one wants to make a mistake in a two out of three falls match, but you are absolutely right, Corey. The first fall is crucial. On the attack from behind, neckbreaker. Got the head scissors on. Oh, oh. elbow in the face. Oh, driving the elbow. Charlotte's keeping the pressure on. Charlotte's got to get it together to avoid disaster. Oh, setting them up. Going to hoist them up high. All the way up and all the way down. Fall away slam. A nice kip up. Across the top rope. Oh, the cover. Stops the count before it, too. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Ooh, look at her answering back. Charlotte with a... Here comes the backpack stunner. Just a continuous rush on Charlotte here. Charlotte. Oh, she's up to no good. Hey! <laughs> Brass knuckles. And some might say you have no margin for error in a two out of three falls match. Well, that's not true. You have a margin for one error, but if you aren't able... Shoulders down! And she picks up a fall early in the match. A demeaning gaze painted on Flair's face. I don't really think this is the most opportune time to be looking for the fans' praise. Knife edge chop! This is an unyielding attack from Charlotte. This is where Charlotte will be tested. What a target of the arm. Charlotte Flair with a trademark chopping. Followed by natural selection. That might topple the queen. And guys, she's dangerously close to a countout loss. What's she waiting for? She's looking more focused on gesturing rather than winning. She had Charlotte's number there. Charlotte might be waking up. But Charlotte still has more to do to get this fully in her favor. Take it down to the canvas. A consistent attack being mounted on Flair. The Queen is holding the leverage in this match. What a hot shot. It's it all the way to the outside for the win. Still in this. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. Yeah. Got the front face lock applied. Nice suplex. Tagging her partner in. Tag. Here she comes. China creates an opening with the counter. Scouted and met with a back elbow. What a shot. Uh-oh. She could be setting up for a submission here. Bailey avoids the assault. From behind. Back suplex. And the role model with a right hand. Hung across the middle. She wants it for the rose plan. Has Bailey ended it there? Bailey connects with a right hand, draping her opponent 